Meh. Unprofessional. What's up, YouTube? Trying to move three here. So, uh, three new uh, decks came out, and I thought I would try them out. Uh, one's Pre Marina, one's Incineroar, and one is Decidueye. Uh, so, uh, I've already played them a little bit each. Um, Pre Marina more than the others, so I'm going to go ahead and start off the series of videos with Pre Marina. And uh, basically, what this deck does is it pulls out either Pre Marina. Lantern, which I'll explain Lantern in a bit, uh, Cloyster or Golduck, and they deal a lot of damage. Um, Premier Ant actually heals itself as well, so that's really good. Cool, I'm gonna give him a hello. Gotta do that. And yeah, I'll go first. Because in uh, theme decks, you usually wanna go first, because uh, they have. Because uh, uh, you can set up your energy first. However, if they have a Meowth that says stall and stall basically says if you go second you can detach an energy from your opponent's pokemon dang it i hate all the starting things uh they're not gonna be grass uh i could go that i don't think it'd be worth <sighs> two energy on a lily pup isn't really the situ uh, ideal situation but you know i'm gonna go with it anyway uh yeah so um it pulls up one of those four things I think I mentioned and uh, it hit they hit really hard pretty much heals itself and does 100 damage uh, I don't want to put the spirit down I think I'm gonna just use that for uh, for fodder <sighs> wingle oh I didn't mean I would put the wingle down but okay kill 30 from this Pokemon I don't even think I have Pelipper in this deck timer ball this card is amazing because you have the potential of getting two uh, really good cards in your hand um i could go for herder but i don't want to use all three energy on it so i think i'm gonna go for do i have a cloister no don't tell me i don't have a cloister i'm having bad luck no okay well <laughs> didn't want to go for it now i have to go for it I'm gonna put an energy on him and just end my turn uh <laughs> so i was looking for a cloister i didn't have one it's in my prize cards uh, that sucks a lot but uh, timer ball says flips you coins for each heads I get a evolution Pokemon and uh, half the time it's you get one which is you know typical of a card um, sometimes well, a quarter of the time you get two and a quarter of the time you get zero when you get zero it's kind of a bummer but uh, her dear her 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 dear uh, says yo fam uh, I can bring it back from the grave so no big deal uh, I don't want to evolve him yet because I want to attack first. Actually, how much does he do? He'd have to get max damage to kill me, so uh, let's go ahead and bite. Yeah, workup would only increase it by 20, which is the same as bite anyway. So, no point in that. Uh, Cloyster just cloister things uh, which is like flip, uh, flip a coin if heads you get more damage if tails you paralyze them and like that's that's usually what uh oh maybe not usually but that's what cloisters tend to do uh that's a bad situation why am i stuck with these three pokemon i didn't oh yeah i forgot about that uh don't want to use timer ball until i see i have better cards in my hand so Let's just hit for 50, and unfortunately, it's at 80, so uh, he'll probably be able to revenge kill me the turn after. Yeah, there's there's that. It's going to hit me. Probably get at least one heads, which makes it do a uh, 40. And if he gets two heads and uh, her, 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 her is just dead, I never learned how to pronounce her, her ear. It's like herding and then ear. Terrier, Herdier. Okay. I think that's how you pronounce it. But it's just Herpaderp. <laughs> I'm sorry if your favorite Pokemon is Herpaderp. But, okay, that's good. That's good. Cool, we got minimum damage. Alright, so I will live another turn with this freaking Hoopa. Uh, Lily is cool, but I want to put an energy down first. Um, I might as well get Max out of it, right? That'll probably end up just being Death Fodder. Uh, 
so uh, Lily is pretty good. Makes you draw till you have six. We, I actually have things I want now, and let's go ahead and use a potion. It's gonna have to stall for a little bit, and let's see if we can get a Primarina and a. Oh yes, we got both. Okay, so we're gonna get. Uh, should I go for a Primarina or should I get a Lantern? I think I'm gonna go for the Evolutionary set. So let's just go for the Evolutionary line. Yes. I can also see that I have a lantern in the uh, prize cards then. So you're going to go fight. So that's dead. I'll get a prize card. Hopefully I get a cloister. That's best case scenario. Or yes, there's cloister. Uh, yeah, cloister says do 30 more. And then the other thing is uh, is they do 20 less to you for 80. I like that. It's not like a amazing, but it's it's good and themed, I guess. Thankfully, I don't think any of my Pokemon are weak to electricity, except for Wingle, but I'm not planning on winning with Wingle, so it's dead fodder anyway. Oh gosh, okay. Galvantula is trouble. That thing hits background, it does account for weaknesses and stuff, so. Uh, so let's go ahead and evolve you. Let's go ahead and evolve you. Course is alright, but you need it like the first few turns. Uh, do I want to put the energy on that or that? I think I want to put it on Cloyster actually, because it already has that energy on it. Um, retreat cost is one. Yeah, let's just go ahead and attack it. Uh, Paradier is probably gonna die. Uh, no, he'd actually have to get uh, something better energy to do anything about that. Uh, though that hoop is gonna kill me. I can already feel it. Okay, I'm gonna put this last one on Cloyster and get the Primarina up to top. Top percent Primarina. Uh, I could save this, but then he could probably kill me with the Hoopa. Why is Herity you're putting in this much work? It should not be putting three energy for a 50 move. No, that that's horrible. Its ability is alright, but I should not be winning with this. And yet I am. He's probably just gonna use the hyperspace. Oh, he's using portal strike? Why? Why would you use portal strike on the herdier? It was almost dead anyway. You might as well just use portal uh, the punch thing like twice. I'm not gonna argue though. Uh gonna put that there. How's alright for theme decks, cause theme decks are just slow. Um, don't really care about those. I do kind of care for the energy. What's what energy do I have in here? Two electric. Uh, uh no, nah, I don't really care right now. I'll get a little, little bit later. Um, yeah. So this will actually protect me, meaning that his attack will do nothing to Cloyster if he tries to hit me. Then I'll kill it next turn, even if he uses a potion. I think. Yeah, even if he uses a potion, I'll kill it with guard press. I could have done a uh, headlock for potential par paralysis or potential 60 damage, but I think keeping this cloister alive is my main priority because it has all the energy on it. Yeah, I don't see anything else with energy on it. Uh, he could still go Galvantula, which will hit things for super effective because it's part of grass. And grass will really hurt me. I don't know why he hasn't done that actually. Why? Oh, he aimed for the cloister as well, but he didn't remember that it doesn't freaking hit it. Okay. Um, I'm actually scared of putting things back there because I think that Galvantula is going to come out. Do I want anything else? I guess I want a, a lantern, right? Yeah, let's get a lantern up. So I'm going to kill off the other Chin Chow. This beer is stupid. <laughs> okay, so uh, I'm going to go ahead and get some energy because I'm low on them right now. Uh, just two electric I think will be fine. Uh, I haven't. I have put an energy down this turn. Okay, so let's go guard press. Kill it off. Uh, 
Yeah, so I think that even if he does bring out this Galvantula, he either kills the Cloyster or he kills the Primarina. I don't think he can kill both. It does have 90. Oh, he's, he's waiting to get an energy for it. I think he doesn't have an electric energy, which is why he's stalling on bringing out Galvantula. You can put a Psychic on it, but... No, that's annoying. Well, I'll kill in one hit, actually. Never mind, it's no longer annoying. He doesn't have energy for it anyway. I think I got this one. Uh, let's go ahead and put up uh, Lantern because I think that Galvantula, if it does come, it's gonna hurt. Uh, what are you at? You're at 80. You just died. So let's go with that. Epic music is playing. By the way, if the music's too loud, let me know because I usually lower it for uh, my own gameplay, but I leave it on for. Uh, recording because I don't know if you guys like this music or not I play my own music but I'm not allowed to because uh, I don't have rights I don't have rights for this music either to be honest but uh, oh, he might go eerie wave that's annoying or actually he can also go burst curse oh he went eerie wave okay oh, that's annoying uh I can still kill it though. I think I'm just gonna kill it. I'm gonna put an electric energy here. What's your retreat cost? Three. Your retreat cost is. Oh gosh, that's annoying. I think it's worth though, because it's the end of the game. I can just kill it. And then I'm back to full. And I think even if his Galvantula comes in with something it can't kill Primarina so I think that's GG I'm just gonna give him a well played yep there's that uh Galvantula does he have it probably not oh he got it wow okay why didn't you do it earlier now it's kind of dead yeah hits for weakness doesn't matter uh he don't need to know what my hand is I'm just gonna go ahead and play it And that is this deck. Uh, let's see what I got out of this. 25, yay! Okay, well, while I have one good game with this and not gonna jinx it, uh, I'm gonna end the recording. So, thank you guys for watching. This is Giant Jump of 3 signing out.